Hey guys, it's been a long time since I've made a video, and I'm so glad to talk to you guys again. Um, I'm going to give you a quick update what's been going on with me. I haven't made YouTube videos in a long time, and I really, when I say I went off the reservation, I'm talking about, well, eat whatever I want to, don't care about raw, don't care about even maintaining a vegetarian lifestyle. Um, <clears throat> after my mom died, I just kind of went off the reservation. And I had so many things that happened. Um, I had a house that went into foreclosure. I had to move. Um, I had uh, uh, got a new <clears throat> job, a new boyfriend, and life just happened. So uh, those things were not good things. None of them. <laughs> so... Um, I just want to catch up with you guys and let you know what's going on. So I got so busy with my job and working 60 or 70 hours a week. Who has time to be raw? Who has time to even think a thought? And that's not a healthy lifestyle, and that's not what I'm doing. So uh, here's what I am doing. Well, let me show you what my lifestyle looks like. This is what my calendar for today looks like. It's eight meetings today. Plus, loads of work. That's BS. These big companies, they pay well, but they take away your life. And it's not worth it, in my opinion. So, today I did something. I have put in my notice for my landlord. I'm moving out of this apartment. I'm going to sell every single item in this apartment. I'm not storing anything. And I'm going to take off. So, check out what I've got here. Let's see. First book. Unforgettable Journeys to Take. World Party. A hundred, a thousand and one historic places. Business travel when it's your money. That's what I need. Traveling solo. And let's see. Tale of a Female Nomad. And I got that off of somebody's channel and I can't remember who it is. But thanks to you, whoever you are. And, um... I'm going to quit my job, quit my job that people would kill for, that I'm so unhappy and can't live a healthy lifestyle. I just broke up with my boyfriend. That probably needed to happen anyway. I love him, but bye. And uh, I'm going to be uh, quitting my job in a couple of weeks. They don't know that yet, but they'll know then. Um, and uh I'm going to take off. I'm going to go spend some time with one of my friends. She told me before I go buying a round-the-world trip, trip ticket to maybe take some time off and just relax. And she lives in rural Georgia. So I'm going to sit there in her trailer, and I'm going to sleep and chill out and maybe help her plan out some farming. And I love urban farming and small farming and maybe get some chickens going. And then I'm going to make my plans from there. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know exactly where I'm going. I'm hoping if one of my friends still lives in Hawaii, I might go see her. Um, she may be moving back to the mainland. And if I go over there, maybe I'll go to Thailand or Australia. I have no idea. I just feel very, very blessed that I am able to do this. I'm not rich, but and I almost bankrupted myself <laughs> taking care of my mother. But uh, I don't know. Things just happen when... you when you need and want them to happen. And I don't know if it's that simplistic, but I just got blessed in a few ways where I can do this, and I'm going to take advantage of it. So, here's my request to you. If you know how to travel on the cheap, I've been watching YouTube videos, and have any suggestions for me, please leave them below. And I would love to know what they are. You are, guys are so much support to me. When I was going raw and I'm back vegetarian again, I just ate a big bowl of blueberries and raspberries and doing all that stuff. Lost some weight, but I don't even want to focus on that right now. Right now I have to focus on becoming happy and I think everything else will take care of itself. So until next time, I wish you much love. I'm scared shitless, but I'm excited. Bye.